Pharmacists have called for increased funding and strategic partnership to boost pharmaceutical research and development in Nigeria. They made a call at the 44th anniversary of the Institute for Advanced Medical Research, College of Medicine, University of Ibado. Olaidu Iwale has the details. Nigeria's pharmaceutical industry faces myriad of challenges from regulatory issues and counterfeit drugs to insufficient funding and adequate infrastructure, which is in turn affecting quality health care delivery. The speakers chosen... Concerned about these problems, medical experts have said that strengthening this sector is crucial for ensuring the availability of quality medications and fostering innovation in drug discovery and development. Yes, if things are done well, companies should be looking for land in Yemen too. The same way we have MIT and we have a hub, or the same way you have the Silicon Valley, the Stanford University, and you have all the companies coming around because they want to feed on the research that is being done. We seek to advance the Institute's work and impact by doing the following. Expanding our capabilities to investigate new and emerging areas of medical science including pharmaceutical drugs, equipping our researchers with world-class training, world-class training and facilities. Can we have an agency that takes the body of the researchers, that sits down and they have a board of trustees looking at everybody's interests, concerns, and their own goal is that we want Nigeria translational, innovative medicines available not only to our Nigeria but to the whole world. The current economic reality of inflation is also a factor affecting the pharmaceutical industry, leading to patients being unable to afford prices of drugs. But what has the Oyo State government done to address this issue? Under the Drug Management Agency as a body, then we now have what we call a drug revolving fund. It involves all the pharmaceutical companies coming together and say, okay, we want to give you drugs, go and use the drugs, and the returns, we can come back. So we are getting direct drugs directly from the producers. And because we are getting drugs directly from the producers, it becomes, it becomes cheaper. The event also serves as a remembrance of a notable personality who contributed to the development of medical research at the Institute, Pakayo de Fashino. Oladio Yewole, TVC News, Ibado.